Hi pretty everyone hope you are doing great all of the people had done with your NEET 2024 exam so how about we have done it just don't worry about it if you have done well good luck if it is not that's fine we will try next time today we will see what are the lines of the NCERT which came in your exam okay basically we are going to decode the questions which are asked in your NEET 2024 exam so for those who are going to repeat or those who want to confirm your answer whether it is correct or not i have made this video from the lines of your ncert i have captured the books okay if you see if this is the question i have uh, captured the answers from your lines of ncert itself and i have showed you from which chapter it is coming from so those who are preparing for the next time also will be beneficial that you will get to know how the questions are getting formed from the lines of ncert and which uh, chapter is having the high weightage without any delay let's get started with the botany okay so the first question is let's is about your lecithin okay they are basically asking what is the lecithin whether it is amino acid phospholipid or carbohydrate if you see from the biomolecule chapter this is the line from where this question is taken there is a definition for your phospholipids along with that they have given the lecithin is one such example so it is basically a direct question we are done with this we are not going to explain in detail just i want to show you what are the lines how the questions are formed okay now the next question is how many molecules of atp and nadph are required for every molecules of co2 fixed in the calvin cycle this is from your photosynthesis in higher plants okay this is also a direct question if you see they have concluded hence for every co2 molecule entering the calvin cycle three molecules of atp and two of nadph are required so the answer would be the last one okay option 4 is the correct answer for this question now we will see the next hint to always cut the dna at a particular point called recognition sequence and it is consist of how many base pairs if you see six base pair it is also given already in your ncert so it is a direct question only this is from your biotechnology chapter the answer will be six base pair for this now this figure everyone might have seen okay so this is coming from your anatomy of flowering plants the question is which component has a thin outer walls and highly thickened walls this if you see the uh, diagram it is directly from your ncert also we have the definitions given right in the anatomy of flowering plants so this question is taken from this now we will move on to the next question the cofactor of the enzyme carboxypeptidase is this is from your biomolecule chapter here this is also a direct question c zinc so zinc is a cofactor for the proteolytic enzyme of carboxypeptidase this is also again a direct question from your biomolecules next we will see the capacity to generate a whole plant from any cell of the plant is called what it is Yes. it is your toti potency right from which chapter it is taken it is from your strategy for enhancement in food production if you see this is also a direct question why i am saying these are direct question there are some question but there is a slight delay in the uh, sentence okay but these and all if you see same has been repeated oh my god okay let me remove this like this capacity to generate a whole plant from any cell or explant is toti potency this is what asking your questions also next we will move on to the next this is basically a match type okay this is from your biological classification they are just asking you the other names let's say rhizophos this is called as the, the bread mold and albugo is the parasitic fungi actually albugo is not that this is one such example i have mentioned if you see there are so many question but these are also basically from your ncert these are from your examples of your ncert that is from your biological classification next this question if you see this is basically a statement question even the statement questions are nowadays directly only let's see now they have given two statement first one bt toxins are insect group specific and coded by gene cry iac right now if you see this is a direct question the toxin is coded by a gene the name has been given so we can say the statement one is correct but the statement two this is where people might have made the mistake just by reading the first few lines right statement two is bt toxin exists at inactive protein in b thuringi cells however after ingestion by the insect the inactive protoxin get activated due to the acidic ph acidic ph this is what mentioned in your question but what would be the there in your ncert it is alkaline ph got it 
how they have twisted many of them might have a wrong answered it wrongly okay this is simple just by reading the starting no you might be thinking yeah i know this answer so i will be answering it but no that is not the case okay so this is from your biotechnology and its application so here statement 1 is correct but statement 2 is wrong let's move on to the next question which of the following is the example of astomorphic floor we have given so many tricks for this no so you might have given easily because this is a normal topic so the astomorphic floor is the example which of the following will show this is for your datura if you see there are three examples right why it's happening there are three example your chilli datura and mustard but in your option only datura is given and it is from your structure organization in your flowering plants okay now we'll move to the next question the type of conservation in which the threatened species are taken out from their natural habitat and placed in a special setting where they can protected and given special care is called this is your ex situ conservation if you see sorry conservation this is also like another direct i could say threatened animals and plant are taken out from their habitat and placed in the special setting to protect them so this is also direct question from your biodiversity and conservation now we will see the next question this is also a okay this the answer is not updated let me move on to the next one yeah the lactose present in the growth of medium of bacteria is transported the to the cell by the action of which of the following if you see again the direct question what is the question is as the lactose how the lactose is transmitted it is transmitted use of the permease so your answer will be permease this is taken from your molecular basis of inheritance so the next one is basically your match the type of the following this is from your microbes and human welfare this should be very easy because uh, these are the direct questions again right so if you see for all of the them i have given you the lines from where it is taking let's say for sarcomyvacl if you see they are used in the production of ethanol right as per your ncrt so your option for this would be ethanol then for trichoderma what it is it is for your cyclosporin a i'm sorry for these guys i'm not sure what's happening okay so i'm sorry not sure what happened so this is for your cyclosporin a then the same for everything so these are basically from your lines of ncrt and from the microbes and human welfare there are no twist happen now come to the next question okay so this is basically the logistic growth equation they are asking what is the k stands for right this is the equation that is figure 13.5 in your ncrt and k is for your carrying capacity this is from your organism and population now we will move on to the next question that is oxen is used by gardener to prepare feed free weed free lands but no damage is caused to to grass as oxen so if you know the functions of oxen we have already given tricks to remember the functions of oxen right if you know the functions of the oxen you will be answering this question because if you see the answer is they do not affect the matured monocot monocot plants okay that is the answer apart from this all the given one not wrong okay so what would be the answer because the oxen do not cause any damage to the grass because they don't affect the monocotyledonous plants okay this is from your plant growth and development now we'll move to the next question identify the part of the seed oh my god i'm sorry few things are not saved properly so yeah given below are two statement okay parenchyma is living but colenchyma is dead tissue the second statement is your gymnosperm lacks xylem vessels but presence of xylem vessel is the characteristics of angiosperm obviously yes you people will know this this is from your anatomy of flowering plants right if you see the gymnosperm lack vessels in the xylem yeah that is right then the presence of xylem vessel is the characteristic feature of angiosperm yeah you are agreeing with that also both are from the lines of ncrt only so both statement are correct this is from your anatomy of flowering plants now we will see the next one these are regarded as the major causes of biodiversity loss there are four points given in your ncrt right so all the four will be coming apart from your mutation and migration all are correct okay so this is from your biodiversity and conservation again now we will move on to the next question which one of the following is not a criterion for classification of fungi this is also very simple yeah it is from your biological classification if you see at the last 
okay before they are dealing with the classification of the fungi at the last these lines would be there so the morphology of the mycelium mode of porous formation and fruiting bodies so apart from mode of nutrition all are the right answer for this question this is from your biological classification the next question identify the type of flower based on the position okay these two are question uh, b and c are given in your question okay b and c are question and if you see b and c both are perigynous both are perigynous based on the position of your flower sorry calyx corolla and androsium with respect to the ovary both are perigynous only morphology of flowering plants is the chapter now we will see the next question list of endangered species was released by who released the list of endangered species it is by your iucn this is from your chapter biodiversity and conservation again okay if you see the IOCN has released some red list on 2014, right? So, this is from your NCRT only. Now, what is the fate of a piece of a DNA carrying only gene of interest which is transferred into an alien organism? This is again, guys, if you see in the NCRT itself, they have already asked this question directly. Simply, they have asked this again also, okay? So, this is from your principles and process in your biotechnology now we will move on to the next question which of the following can be explained on the basis of mendel's law of dominance okay so what are the outcome of your mental law of dominance these are your outcome right whether these are there is a district unit that is called as your factor and factor occurs in pair and in a dissimilar pair of factor one will be a dominant one will be a recessive so these are from your principles of inheritance with the law of mental inheritance will be there no i'm sorry law of dominance okay yeah now we will move on to the next one incubation of succinic dehydrogenase enzyme by malanote is a classical example of okay if you see this is again from your biomolecule and this is your classical example of your competitive inhibitor right because if you see this is about your comp competitive inhibitor and at last they have mentioned the example as incubation of succinic dehydrogenase and that they have asked in the question. Okay, now we'll move on to the next question. Formation of interfascicular cambium from fully developed parenchyma cell is the example of your dedifferentiation. If you see, they have said what is the phenomenon dedifferentiation means then have given one example what is the example formation of meristem or interfascicular cambium or core cambium from fully differentiated parenchyma cell okay so this is from your plant growth and development next one spindle fiber attached to kinetochores of chromosome during which phase they are asking this is from your cell cycle and cell division c this is from your lines of ncrt that is from metaphase okay one or metaphase two simply it is metaphase okay if you see the kinetochore will be attaching to the chromosome this is the question they are asking now tropical regions show great diversity okay tropical regions show great levels of species richness because so what are the reasons that they are showing rich level of species all are mentioned in your para like they have given the question what is so special about tropics that might have account for the greater biological diversity and the answer is also given in the para wherever there are multiple answers i'm just not discussing to save the time this is from your biodiversity and conservation now so basically i'm giving you idea what are the chapters and from which lines they are taking the question how they are taking the questions okay now given below are two statement again a statement question the first one will be chromosome become gradually visible under the light microscope during leptotin stage let's see yeah if you see in your ncrt also they have given it will become gradually visible and during the leptotin so statement one is correct right now we will see the statement two. What is your statement two? The beginning of diplotene stage is recognized by dissolution of synaptonomal con complex. Yeah, this is also right, no? Because in NCRT also they have given the same. The beginning of the diplotene stage will be marked by the dissolution of the concept. So the, both the statement are correct in this question, and this is from your cell cycle and cell division. Now. Bully form cells are responsible for which of the following? This is from your anatomy of flowering plants. And if you see, your bully form cells are uh, responsible for curl. Leaves curl inward toward the minimum loss of water. Okay, these are the use, use of your uh, bully form 
cell okay option one is correct now the next one a pink flowered snapdragon plant was crossed with a red flowered snapdragon plant what type of phenotype is expected in the progeny so it is basically you are based on the income dominance i can't say just the line is there and the answer is there okay if you have read and understood the incomplete dominance this is obviously easy only so what you will be getting you will be getting the red flower as well as the pink flower right in your income oh my god okay you will be getting both of this color right so this is from your incomplete dominance that is your yeah now we will move on to the next question a transcription unit in dna is definitely defined primarily by the three regions in the dna right so these are with respect to upstream and downstream end okay that is the main point and see what are the three points of the transcription unit this is from your molecular basis of in and it is a direct question a promoter structural gene and it terminator option 4 is the correct one for this one let's see the next one in a black pant sorry in a pant black seed color is dominant over white seed color so in order to find out the genotype of the black seed plant which type of the following genotype will be cross set okay if you want to find the genotype which one you will be using how will I, okay here also the answer just in got updated basically you will be using this bb right oh not sure what's happening with my system so it is it the answer would be bb right and this is also from your genetic lesson only some of the answers have been not saved properly sorry for the confusion let me move on to the next one okay okay after this i haven't updated the question some things are not saved properly sorry for that so basically uh, i have moreover covered almost all the questions of the botany questions from your need paper okay i hope now you have gotten from which lines of ncit these questions are there how they are asking the question soon i will be posting up for zoology also so yeah and i am also going to post an important video that if you want to do something in the healthcare apart from need apart from being a doctor i'll be posting a video soon please look into that don't lose your heart uh, we will do something okay so don't be worried if you have got something less in your neat exam that's fine there are people who are getting uh, less marks right it's not like everyone should get the first rank then the first rank won't have any value so yeah see you in the next video bye bye happy